Here with Dan Weldon at the Spirit of Sports, St. Vincent Sports Performance Awards. This is an off weekend for you on the track, but you're staying busy, it looks like. Yeah, I mean, this is, um, I, I've had a long relationship with everybody at St. Vincent, in particular R Ralph Reef, um, Tim Drudge, and, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's been, uh, there's been a lot of great things that we do with, with uh, St. Vincent's. We, I always do the hospital visit um, at the Children's Hospital shortly before the, the month of May really kicks off. Um, I've obviously trained at their, uh, you know, their, their, their physical fitness center. Uh, they've also, you know, they've, they've put me back together a little bit. I, luckily, I haven't had too bad of crashes, <laughs> but they've, they've put me back together or, or, or try to fix me up a little bit when I've had uh, a few that I've had. And, you know, for, for me, this is, um, you know, it's almost like giving back. It's, uh, I think, when you're able to do things like this, I, I personally feel very honored. It's, um, you know, Indianapolis, I was saying to my wife on the way here, it's, it's been a great city for me. Um, you know, there's a lot of great things about the city, and obviously it's a sports city. So to, to be able to, to attend a function like this and, and give out some awards to some great athletes is, is something that I'm extremely proud of. We've seen you working out in the past quite often. And tell me about the maybe the specific regimen they put the drivers through, maybe different than their football players or something like that. Well, I think that's what's great about um, St. Vincent's. You know, Ralph Reef and, and, and Tim Drudge, they really wanted to cater to, to you know, it, it doesn't matter if you're a racing driver or a football a footballer, basketball player, you know, they, they cater to, to what you go through and your body type. You know, so, some people have, you know, weaknesses in, in different areas and, and they really, you know, focus on, on that weakness to, to, in effect, try and make it a strength. And, um, you know, their attention to detail and, and the, the time they put into kind of analyzing what will suit you best and, and make you perform for me better on the racetrack is, uh, has, has been a huge help in my career. And, um, you know, I, I have to, you know, give a, lot of th give a lot of thanks to them because they've done an extremely good job. You've seen a lot of talented scholar athletes out in the crowd, and I'm sure it's good to give back to them and to see, you know, they look up to you as a role model as well. Yeah, it is. It's um, you know I'm at a stage in my career now where to to be able to do things like this is um, you know I think very important. There was uh, you know times when I was at functions like this and you know I was looking up to those people and um, you know they they were people that I, I think I I remember doing a lot with um, where where Paint Manning was uh, you know giving out awards and stuff like that and there's uh, a lot to be learned from um, a superstar like like Peyton so it's it's for, for me like I say it true it truly is an honor and uh, I, uh, I I would like to think that I'm a good role model and uh, you know I'd I'd, uh, I'd like to think that these uh, a lot of the people in this room will, will go on to great things and I'm sure that will be the case take me through uh, your season maybe at, at this point we saw the second place finish in India and now you're getting ready for the Canada swing uh, yeah some things you like better but where are you at right now no I, th I think we're, we're really excited for the second half of the season like you say Indianapolis was very strong for us um, we were very very competitive at Watkins Glen a lot of the road courses have been um, you know very strong this year I think we were very very strong at Long Beach we just that that, that result didn't reflect our true pace but it's it's, it's been um, a very very good season so far I you know when we haven't broken to victory lane yet but we really feel that we're putting ourselves in a position to be able to do that and that's why everybody at the team is so excited for, for the second half for the season. We always look forward to those satellite interviews after the races outside Indianapolis. Uh, so there's a couple maybe we can we can plan on having you on uh, in the next couple weeks. Absolutely. I, I you know I love doing them. So uh, it will uh, it will definitely be a good interview if uh, if, if we get in victory lane. And I, I'm sure with with the effort that the team are putting in and um, you know every, everything uh, that they're doing back at the shop. Even right now they're working hard to put some great cars together for us for Canada. Uh, we'll we'll be there no doubt. All right. Well, thanks for being here to support the kids and uh, good luck this weekend.